It's the T-34 tank in its full magnificence. The interior is not very comfortable, but you can almost touch history in it. When moving, the heavy beast impresses everybody, retaining its charm also in miniature size. If somebody knew how much effort it requires to make it look as it looks, they wouldn't say it's a toy. It's rather a work of art. During the International Festival of Plastic Scale Models, could see more than a thousand of such masterpieces. Plenty of models, incredible amount. I'm feeling a bit overwhelmed taking photos. I was going to take photos of all of them, but I'm afraid I won't manage. So, I'm choosing only those I like most. The appearance is not all, though. For some, the details is what really counts. At a certain point, I started to pay attention to certain details of making the models. It was completely automatic. Anyway, it's nice to come and have a look. The variety of presented models and creativity of their authors is really astonishing. Not only those gleaming ones are admired. It's just the opposite. It's nicely destroyed, burned. You can see it's been through a lot. To have such results, you need to put a lot of effort. This ship has been built for five years. It not only charms with its appearance, but it also floats. It's steered with a remote control. It works. I'm sure it works. It's after the first tests. Only in a bathtub, but I know it works. The idea of Bitom's festival has proved to be right. Ten years ago, when it took place for the first time, it wasn't as popular as it is now. Not all participants were aware of their model-making skills. The competition formula was not well received at first, as some people were scared. But finally, the competition formula helped them to spread their wings. Their hobby is infectious. They say, once you try, you will be making models all your life. What really impresses me is the number of visitors in here. The fact that everybody notices something interesting. I'm a lover of aviation and military vehicles, American and Russian ones. So that's what I'm paying attention to. A novelty of the festival was a series of workshops for model makers, run by professionals. Opinions of the participants were unanimous. A very successful event, great program and fantastic models. The standards have been set up really high. Is it possible to get still surprised here? The organizers convince they aren't lacking ideas and invite everybody for the next edition in March 2014.